<laughs> Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. Mother Cluckers. She can be Santa. All right, so oh, today am I Santa? you are Santa. I can't see the sun. Let's get out of the sun. So we're in sunny San Diego, and um, sunny California. Today we're gonna be talking about how to stay off Santa's naughty list. Sorry, I had to make sure didn't hit, didn't hit, didn't get Let's hit by a, a sleigh. Faster. There's a car. Don't want to get hit by no sleighs. We're okay. Almost across the street. So, guys. Uh, say what's up if you're popping on. Um, obviously, um, again. I'm Ryan, this is Wes. Uh, we run a company called Intentional Lifestyle Creators. Uh, feel free to check out our website at ilcuniversity.com where we show network marketers how to truly create balance so they can live their dream lifestyles by showing them how to use the internet in their businesses, right? So feel free to check us out. Today, we're gonna give you three tips on how you can stay off Santa's three. naughty list. Okay, because here's the deal. There's way too many people out there telling themselves that they're broke. They're, they're telling themselves that this time of year has to be a, a tight time of year. It's got to be a time of year where, um, you know, you, you, you don't get what you want or whatever. And I want you to understand, you know, this time of year, is, it's, it's supposed to be the best time of year. You know, Full of joy and peace mm -hmm. and love. Abundance. Okay, yep. that's, that's that's why it's the season of giving. So we're gonna share three things. So if you've ever said to yourself, you know, um, if you ever said to yourself, you know what, this is just a broke time tight of year, time. it's a tight time of year, or if you know someone else that has said that, I want you to share this out. That way we can get this message out to a lot of people because we're gonna give you some tips on how to do that. All right. Fun fact: I heard this yesterday. There's so much money in the world. Okay, there's actually so much money in the world that. There's enough money in the world that we could all, every person on this planet could have a net worth of over a billion dollars. A billion, okay? So obviously, if you don't have a piece of that or if you feel like you know, you're just not making enough money, yeah, a billion, okay? That's right, that's a lot of freaking money, all right? And a lot of us aren't getting that share of that billion dollars, right? There's not a, a um, what do you call it, a shortage of money. Okay? There's not a shortage of money. Actually, there's an abundance of money. Yeah. But all of a sudden, we're all broke during Christmas somehow. Okay? All of a sudden, we, all, we don't have money or this is a tight time of year. Right? Oh and it doesn't have to be... <laughs> and it doesn't have to be that way. So tip number one is, is you got to stop telling yourself that um, you're broke or it's a tight time of year. You know what I mean? you yeah. got to stop telling yourself that. I mean, that should be a rule all year but especially this time of year stop i mean you're you're not broke like you knew this time of year was coming mm -hmm. all year right <laughs> right nothing so. has changed literally right. nothing has changed um you know one of the things that that um the point that we want to make is people are spending money okay so get i just want you to understand this and let us know with emojis if you're feeling it also let us know if you share um we want to give you a shout out for sharing we want to get this out to a lot of people but one big thing understand that People are spending more money or they're in the months of November and December than they are Ooh. any time of year. Switch, Santa oh, switch, oh, oh. Santa switch. Okay, <laughs> now, now, if people are spending way more money this time of year and they aren't spending it with you, then who is the problem with? Is the problem with other people or is the problem in the mirror? Santa switch. How, wait. You, Santa switch. You can't do ah! that. Santa switch on them. Not even fair. Santa switch on them. Hey. Stupid. <laughs> okay, but understand that. I mean, that should be kind of an aha. I mean, it may be like an aha moment or kind of a, like a oh god moment, right? People are spending money, more money than they usually spend right. all year long. So they're spending it with somebody, and if they're telling you they're broke and don't have money, then that's an issue okay that's an issue so one we got to yeah. get to the place where if you're telling yourself that you're broke and you don't have money and this is a tight time of year you got to find you got to you got to get sick and tired of saying that out loud how long do you want to keep saying that out loud right how long do you keep do you, I mean are you looking for some type of um, of gratification of someone else are you looking for some type of agreement from somebody else saying oh yeah you know what it's tight for me too it's time for me. Don't come around us talking about 
how tight it is. You know what I mean? Because we're not going to give nope. you that. We're not going to give you that satisfaction of saying, you know what, yeah, it's tight for You're us like, too. Okay, what are you going to do about it? Santa switch. Go ahead and have it. Just have it then. <laughs> just random Santa Gosh. switching on us. She just really wants that Santa. Look at Okay, Merry Christmas. No, you can have it. No, just take it. it. Take it. I don't even want I can't it. Even take there it. are plenty of Santas I can have. <laughs> <laughs> Look, the season of giving. So that's actually point number two is um, if you want every Christmas to be, if you want the next Christmas to be different, if you want this time of year to be different, understand that money is meant to be spent. Money right. is meant to be circulated. That's why it's called currency. It's a current. It's meant to be put into circulation. The it's more you, sorry, the more you give, the more you receive. Mm -hmm. It's not meant for you just to hold on to and be stingy with it. If you're feeling broke, Chances are you have a really tough time parting with money. Chances are you, you have a tough time at the register buying things. You may have a tough time going out to eat. You may have a tough time uh, doing certain things. Santa switch on them. Oh, that was nice. Right? Santa right? switch on That's them. That's so nice. Right? Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> Santa switch. So, again, if you look in the mirror, if you have, a, if you have trouble spending money, if you have trouble parting ways with money, maybe it's getting the coach you want. Maybe it's buying the courses or the books or attending the events. We're at an event right now. Um, you know, if you have trouble parting ways with money, you're gonna have a really tough time um, having money get to you. you tried. <laughs> Give it here. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I mean. And so again, look for different ways that you can. Uh, give this year. Look for different ways that you can spend money and put money back into the economy and, and yeah. put money back into your communities. Yeah. So just real quick, what we're actually doing right now, I don't want it anymore. Just take it. <laughs> see what I deal with. What we're, what we're doing is we're putting together like bags for the homeless people full of like winter stuff. So like socks, blankets, um, heat warmers, scarves, scarves, umbrellas, things like that. We're Gloves. making bags and we're going to hand, hand them out. We're going to take the kids and we're going to go hand them out. Um, think of stuff like that. Little like stuff. give, give and you shall receive. It's not it's the true. first time you heard it. It's true. It's true. But understand how money works. That's, that's the principle that if you don't adopt that principle, then chances are every holiday is going to end up being the same. Where right. you where where you just scrap where you're scrapping everything together, you feel like you just aren't abundant. And when you when you give, you 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 create the feeling of abundance. You know, abundance is all around us. That's what they say, right? Abundance. Yeah. We're swimming in abundance. Yeah. That's, that's that big sign up. Take this damn Santa. So we're swimming in abundance, <laughs> right? And the more we're you give, the more you oceans of abundance. The more you're gonna feel like you've got enough. The more that you're going to feel right. like you've got more than enough. Because every time you give, you should feel like, oh, you know what, I had I had too much. Mm -hmm. Right? So I had to give it away. Okay? And the last tip, if ooh, you're taking ooh, notes. Ooh, sorry, sorry. Can uh -huh. I just throw in this one thing? Because we talked about it today. Throw it in the Santa um, bag. We talked about um, you are rich. So you are rich because you've had everything that you've needed in order to survive up till you're now. You're here, right? Right. You here, right? You may have skipped a meal. You may have been homeless at one point, but you are rich because you've always had everything you needed in order to survive. Mm -hmm. Rich isn't about money. It's about it's about a level of appreciation. That is annoying. You know what's annoying? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what that is. Rich richness comes down to appreciation. Richness comes down to gratitude. That's what that's how right. richness is measured. Okay. So if you want to feel rich, be in gratitude. The more yeah. the more gratitude you're in, the richer you'll feel. All yeah. right. Last tip. Last tip that we'll give to you. If you want Christmas to be different, if you want the holiday times to be different, um, do something different. How something many different. years in a row are you gonna have that excuse every single year? Like, oh, it's different. hard times. Oh, you know, it's a rough time of year. Okay. How long are you gonna keep saying that? Or are you going to do something different so you don't feel like you have to say that next year? Yep. Yep. You got to do I mean, when the things come up to say, you know what? Oh, you know, oh, yeah, but I got to, I, I got to, I don't want to start this business because we got to get the kids something. Okay. You want to throw the universe a curveball? <clears throat> don't get your kids something. Don't get your kid. 
Or you may say, you know what, <laughs> kids, we're not going to go overboard this year with gifts, right? You know, we're going to keep it simple. I mean, do something different. <clears throat> Find a way. No, it's cool. You know what? It's cool. It I'm just going to roll with it. I'll just, I mean, Find it a way. wants to come to me. Abundance. I know. Stay in abundance. <laughs> <laughs> Subundance. So find ways to switch it up. Find ways to switch up your routines. Find ways to switch up your holiday routine. Find ways to do something. If, if, if you're tired of looking around at your holiday life and you're like, man, this just isn't working for me, switch it up a little bit. Do something different. All right? So um, we're actually way oh, late shit. for this way event. Late. So uh, we're going to be rolling in, strolling in with zero integrity. And uh, <sighs> yeah. So hey. But Just some tips from the ILC we people. We wanted to share with y'all. Mm -hmm. So, go out Enjoy there. Enjoy this season, okay? Don't just make it all about, like, the stressing and blah, blah, blah. Just enjoy this season. Give, um, volunteer, enjoy, bring the joy back into the season and back into life. Bring peace within yourself, your family, <laughs> others. I don't need it. I thought I was going to sneeze it to you. I, I don't need All right, it. guys. Hey, okay. if, you, if you want access to our new free community, uh, feel free to go to ilcuniversity.com forward slash free. All right, get access to our free community. Take our free 14-day go full-time challenge so you can go full-time in your home business. All yep. right. If there's anything that we can ever do for you, feel free to hit us up, shoot us a text message, and just tell us exactly what you want help with, and we can help you create the lifestyle of your dreams with your home business. All right, guys. We're out of here. We'll catch you later. Love y'all. All right. See you guys. Have a good day.